<laughs> well, good morning from a rainy LeGrand Park on our she's fifth really annual. She's really a Yankee fan, but we won't say anything. <laughs> oh, oh, ouch. Wait a second. Yankee fan? Good morning. Good morning. So we're down here. Um, the rain is drizzling, but we know that by race time, the rain is supposed to move out and everything will be nice and clear for our 5K. And this is Republican rain. <laughs> And what's awesome about this race is, is that all the money, after we pay for our expenses, gets put back into the Recreation Commission for our programming for our kids and our seniors. And that's what today is all about. So, if you're not here today, you should be with us next year. Yeah. Beautiful day here at the Family 5K. Hope to join you. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the Fanwood 5K and Family Fun Run. Is everybody ready to have a good time? Oh, come on. We want them to hear them in Scotch Plains. Is everybody ready to have a good time? Much better. We are going to have a great time today. In just a few minutes, we are going to start the Family Fun Run. At this time, everybody who is registered for the Family Fun Run, Please make your way to in front of the DJ booth. Everybody who is registered for the Family Fun Run, please make your way to the DJ booth. We will be talking more about the Fanwood 5K very shortly. We are gonna have a great day. We have prizes for all the children participating in the Family Fun Run. Listen up, get ready to have a good time. Come on over to the DJ booth. We're gonna do a little stretching and kicking and jumping and get ready. We will not be going into the street until the time is right. Our Fanwood, our Fanwood Police Department is in the process of closing down the streets. We will not do anything that is not safe. So ladies and gentlemen, we all go into the street together. Please all stay together at this time. Come out from under the awning. We are gonna stretch and get ready. Are we ready for a family fun run? I don't know. Did you hear anything? No. I didn't hear anything. No. Let's try that again. We have a camera that's going to video everybody. So let's try that loud. Are we ready for a family fun run? That's a, let's see all the hands up in the air. One, two, three. Let's see that family fun run. Oh, yes. I'm very concerned. Everybody looks tired. I think we need to do a stretch. So, while we wait to close the street, which they're doing right now, we're going to start doing a stretch. So, I'm going to ask the DJ for some really good jumping, running, kicking, laughing. You're going to watch me. We're going to get started. Are you ready? Let's hit it, DJ. Oh, we got to be ready for this. Oh, wow. When we're done with the race, on the on the end right over here. Is it New Jersey water, right? American water. I always forget that part. Yeah, we have New Jersey American Water's truck on the side. So when you're thirsty, because this one mile race is going to make everybody exhausted. I'm already exhausted saying it. We have them donating water for everybody. Now, after the race, we're going to meet right back here by the DJ booth. As you're going, now does everybody know where we're going? We're gonna start on the street right over here. 
We're gonna go all the way up, all the way around, all the way around, and all the way back, and we're gonna end at the same place we start. Everybody got it? Ending at the same place. We will have volunteers on the streets. If you have any questions, just ask the volunteers. Also, we are waiting. The chief will be closing the street any minute. We are waiting for final safety features. Safety is first. Everybody, I want everybody getting close, get ready to go on the street. I'm gonna get to go, go ahead and okay, and we're all gonna head on the street. I need about two or three minutes. Everybody get close, and we'll go very short. Good morning. I'm Colleen Moore, I'm your mayor, and I wanna thank you for making the choice to bring your kids out here and start on a healthy Sunday morning when you could have been doing anything else, especially when you looked out and it was raining. Real quick, all the money that we raised today, that goes through the fees after we pay our expenses goes right back into our programming for our kids and our seniors here in Fanwood. So thank you for that. It really helps kids with opportunities who can't afford our programs as well as keeping the rates low for our seniors. Have a safe run. Thank you kids. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you coming out this morning. Good morning. Uh, once again, thank you for everyone's uh, participation today. I'm Chief Trigger of the Family Police Department, so on behalf of the Police Department, thank you. Uh, the main thing we need to do with the runners today, we've got a lot of kids out here at this event. Just watch people, we have, we have field marshals all over the course, but just watch some people that might be backing out of driveways. And we have officers on the course to slow anyone down that gets there, but just understand with the rain, cars take a little bit longer to stop. So. Run this race exactly like you would if you were running uh, with the flow. We'll run against the flow of traffic, okay, as a regular pedestrian. And let's have a safe race and good luck to everybody and thanks again for your participation. After you come up this way, everyone go right into the park, uh, right into the park and get off the street because you're going to see a mad dash of people trying to get over to uh, Martin for the big run. So again, thank you for your participation and good luck. I think I died. No worries. No worries. All right, remember, when everybody's done with the race, where do we go? Yeah. In the park. This is the start location and the end location. Let me get thumbs up. Are we ready? Yeah. All right. One minute while we get a close street. Yeah. I need all the children to do me a favor today. Let's be safe. Let's have fun. And let's jump in puddles. Yay! Yeah! <laughs> all right. Oh, here we go. What is it? The 5K. Who are you going to run it with? My dad. Awesome. Do you like running? Yeah. Um, so how do you think you're going to pace yourself? I'm slow. Slow? Mm -hmm. Awesome. I think you're going to do a good, good job. So let's say, we love Fanwood TV. We love Fanwood TV. Thanks, buddy. Good luck. Thank you. Okay. Let me see some game day faces. <laughs> Race day. Do you have the jitters? Yes. <laughs> What'd you do to prep? Uh, just run. Just run? Yeah. Okay. How are you feeling? Good. Feeling good. Feeling good? Yep. Awesome. What's your name? Michelle. Forgot to ask you your name. Jaime. Jaime. All right. Good luck. How are you feeling? Fine. <laughs> well, good luck to you. How'd you guys prepare? Uh, a lot of, lot of preparation. A lot of preparation. Yeah. A lot of drinking. <laughs> yep. Scotch. Water. He's Water. A He's a <laughs> Scotch beer. <laughs> and you? What he said. Same. Uh, a lot of running. Running. Yeah. Nice. Oh, I know you. Hello. <laughs> What'd you do to prep? Just run. <laughs> Just run. Awesome. You're gonna do great. And let me see your race day face. I'm a little tired from running race yesterday. All right. Rest up. Rest up for a second. All right. Ready to go. Yes. 
that's beautiful. One more. Mm. Nice. All right, good luck, guys. All right, is everyone ready? Woo! All right, on your mark, get set, go! And the timeout. So I'm with uh, the captain of the EMT squad. Can you tell us your name? Patty Buckridy. Hi, it's so nice to be chatting with you. I know you guys work so hard all the time for this town. And we're here at the Fanwood 5K race. So can you tell us what you're doing here today? Well, we provide standby services for the runners in the event that when they are running and if there's any accidents and we kind of we send an ambulance after them, chasing them as they're going through the, uh, the race. And um, if there's any injuries or anything, we treat them. So, I mean, I have to ask, it's, it's a race. Have you ever seen, in all your years, this is the sixth annual, have you seen any real bad injuries? In a 5K race, no, not usually. Not, not usually. usually. When it's really hot out, we get heat exhaustion, we get people that get dehydrated and that kind of thing, and sometimes we'll have to transport. But for the most part, we really don't see bad injuries. Runners can handle themselves? Yeah. If my sister was running though, I mean, she's got some pretty bad luck. <laughs> she's, she rolls her ankles out, she scrapes her knees up, so she would need you guys. So we're, we're glad to have you here helping. <laughs> Thank you very much. We're glad to help. <laughs> Thank you again. One, go Derek! 180. Hi, so what's your name? Mike Bange. I'm operations manager for New Jersey American Water. That's cool. My Oh, my cousin's last name is Bange. That's it's a right. good Irish name. <laughs> so what are you doing here volunteering for Fanwood? Today with the 5K, so we come out um, and give out water. We hold the water station here for Fanwood for their 5K run. So it's something we do uh, every year, not only Fanwood, but other towns in our service area. Um, when they have an event, they'll call us, we'll get them on the calendar, and all our volunteers besides us will come out and give out water for that event that day. Do you have any special affiliation with Fanwood? Uh, it's one of my towns I take care of in my area. I have 24 towns in my area. That Say I'm you love it. One of my favorite towns in my area <laughs> that I take care of. One of your... <laughs> <laughs> Well, thank you so much for helping out and helping our runners. Thank you very much. Great to be here. Thank you. Hey, I know you're so tired. Thanks for being in an interview with us. What's your name? Michelle. Michelle. Okay, so how did you think you did? Uh, not as great as the last few years, but... How long have you been running? Uh, since I'm 22. 12 or 20 years. Whoa, you look like a baby. Come on. It must be all the running. Yeah, must be. <laughs> Thanks. So, wait, I just have a quick question. What is it? What's the appeal with running? I don't know. I, I just can't, I can't see it. Well, it's a challenge, yeah. physically, and um, really, mental and your body are together, you can accomplish anything. Wow, that's inspirational. Yeah. Thank you. Um, so, are you a resident of Fanwood? Uh, Scotch Plains. Scotch Plains? Okay, so you like to make this Fanwood 5K, I'm guessing. Yeah, I've done it, I think this is my fifth year. Okay, yes, the sixth annual. Okay, so maybe six. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Awesome. Thank you for always coming out and supporting Fanwood. No problem. Thank you for letting me get, catch my breath. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> What's your name? Kate Johnson. Yeah, did you do gymnastics? I did not. No, swimming. Oh, swimming. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I knew a Kate Johnson. Yeah. But, okay, so you, it's got to be an athlete name. Uh, I, guess, I guess so, yeah. <laughs> Have you been running for long? Um, I ran at Scotch Plains Fenwood High School on the track team and cross country with Mr. Cagle. Um, and I swam in college out in Shippensburg University. So I'm um, just trying to stay in shape now that I've graduated. Um, oh my gosh, so did you know my sister Caitlin Magnus? Yeah. She ran with Mr. Cagle. That's cool. Very cool. Um, all right, so how, how many 5Ks have you done? Um, several, although this is our first one together. Um, and who? This is Remington. Remington, hello! Uh, he's only about <laughs> He's only about 17 months old, so I uh, just started running with him about a month ago. So. That's cute. That reminds me of um, Rocky Balboa. Have you seen it, running with his dog? Yes, absolutely. Motivation right there. Well, thank you for talking with yeah, us, both absolutely. of you. Thank you. <laughs> Have a great day. <laughs> and what are your names? 
names? Angelique. Mike. Ruccio. Did you guys um, register for this race together? No. No? You're just friends? No. Nope. Um, we just I, met I guess we just met. <laughs> you're, race, yeah. you're just race, race buddies. buddies. That's so cool. Running brings people together. Yes. <laughs> so, have you been running a long time, either of you? Uh, mostly treadmill, not so much outside. This is only my second year doing this, running outside. Well, congratulations. How about you? For about three or four years, so a little bit, yeah. Nice. So, how do you think you guys did today? Not bad, but I think I beat my time from last year, which was my goal. Nice. I think I did okay, yeah. Happy to finish and yes. be done with it. Ready for next year. Yeah, and how are you feeling? Good. Yeah? I mean, I asked this, I asked some other people because I'm really trying to figure this out. I don't see the appeal of running. My sister does it, but what is it about running? I think it's just the adrenaline, like trying to, I'm just trying to beat myself. You know, like I, my goal from last year was to beat myself. So I didn't really, wasn't paying attention to who was passing me or who was ahead of me or behind me. It's just all for me. So it's just like a goal I set for myself to achieve and complete. I mean, I mean, that makes sense. What about you? Any insight? Um, for years, I've never really enjoyed running at all, but it's a good exercise. It's a good challenge and just setting goals and getting out and exercising, really. Yeah. It's also like a clearing your mind kind of thing because you're just kind of like, you know, out there and all. Like for me, I just have the music in my ears and there's really nothing else to focus on, but, you know, like, you know. Peaceful. Peaceful. Um, one more thing, are you guys from Fanwood? I am originally. I don't live here right now, but I am originally. My parents are still here. Good to come back, right? I love coming back. What about you? Uh, yeah, I live in Fanwood. I've been here for about eight years with wife and three girls, yep. All right, this is for Fanwood TV, so let's, let's just say, go Fanwood. Go Fanwood. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, Thank thanks you. guys. Okay. And what's your name? Luis Avanto. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. And is this your first run? No, no. It's this is my seventh seven run this year. I come, Whoa. I'm from uh, Pennsylvania, east of Pennsylvania, and uh, to run up here. How did you hear about this run? Oh, uh, I hear about the, the internet. The internet, yeah. wow. So you love, you love to run, huh? Oh, yeah. Yes, I love to run. What got you into it? Uh, excuse me? What got you into running in the first place? Uh, no, uh, I am running because I was sick some time day. And it stopped run, start running and it disappeared the pain until today, over 30 years ago. So it's like a natural healer. Yeah. That's great. How do you think you did today? Oh, I'm a little bit slow because a lot of humidity. Also, Tuesday when I was making my last, my last training, I, I, feel, I feel something in my leg. I don't want force today. I should be making 28 or 29 minutes, but I have 30 minutes is okay for me. I am very happy. You're very happy? Yeah. All right, congratulations. Thank Thanks for speaking with us. You're welcome. Thank you. Hey, how, how are, are you? you? Good. Good. And what's your name? Heather. Hi, Heather. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Are you a resident of Fanwood? Um, actually, Colonia. Colonia. Okay. How'd you hear about this race? Um, I've heard about people doing it before. I know it's a great run, so I just came down here, a couple of my friends, and uh, here we are today. Is this your first 5K? No. Um, I've done a couple now, a few half my, uh, marathons. So, I love it. Do you think you did well today? Definitely. It was very um, greatly organized, well run, so it was a great day. Thank you. Thank you, and congratulations. Thank you. Have a great day. Hello. What's your name? Erin Sinclair. You did an awesome job. I just want to tell you that. Is this your first race? No. No, not at all. I've run this a couple times. This one in Vanwood? Yeah. Awesome. How long have you been running for? 15 years. Nice. So you're a real true runner. Yeah. Where are you from? Here, Fanwood. Awesome. So nice that you came out to support Fanwood. Thank you. What got you into running? Uh, I just love, I like to exercise. You said you couldn't beat me. You said you couldn't beat me. Sorry. Um, got me into uh, running. Uh, well, I work in rehab, so it's beneficial for the body and its nature to exercise. Yeah, so great to see. Thank you so much. Go get some water. <laughs> Hi guys. Found some running buddies. What are your names? Uh, Janine, Renee, Susanna. Awesome. How did you hear about this race? Just running 5Ks around town. We live in Westfield. Okay. So is this your first 5K? No. 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 I'll run no. different ones. Different ones? Okay. How do you how do you feel that you did today? Good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah? What was your, what was your best time ever? Oh gosh. Oh. I think 29. That's 29. You're 20. back into running. Yes. 
Yeah. All right, yeah. so you all like are in generally the same time frame? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, stuck yeah. Together. yeah. yeah. They stuck together? Cool. Yeah. All right, so maybe you'll have a different answer for this question. Um, what got you into running? I have five kids, so finally got into running. <laughs> yeah. I have four, but I started at the first one, so okay. just a break, just a break from the day-to-day -day stress and to take care of yourself mentally and physically. And to run away from the kids. Pretty much. <laughs> and to run away from the kids. That's funny. Yeah, they'll catch up to you. Personally, I don't like running, so I need to hear these answers. Yeah, just get some fresh air. Yeah. Fresh okay. air. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you for chatting with us. Thank this you. is Fanwood TV, by the way. Oh, great. Thank you. Have a good one. Bye. Bye. Hey, Lee. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> this is my neighbor, Lee. Uh, how long have you been running 5Ks? I've been running probably for about 20 years. <laughs> 20 years. And how do you think you did today at this uh, one? Actually, I did. Uh, I did pretty well. I, I'm, I'm happy with my time. <laughs> And what was your time? Do you know it? It was 28.52. Not to put you on the spot. That is awesome. Congratulations. Thank you. Not bad for an old man. You know what I've been asking a lot of people today? Um, you know my sister. She's a runner, Caitlin. Yes, yes. But I'm not. So I was asking for like some tidbits, some inspiration for why running is so great. That's, uh, that's a good question. <laughs> um, what uh, what I what I love about running is uh, you know just running for a half hour at a good pace, get up a good workout, um, as opposed to riding bike. We might have to ride for an hour, an hour and a half. So, a uh, quick half hour run in the morning or when you get home from work just, uh, makes you feel good for the rest of the day. And what about music? It's an excuse to listen to good music. You know what? You want to know why I just said that? Tell me. Because Bruce Springsteen just came on in this in Le Grand Park, my favorite musician. We know Bruce is your favorite. <laughs> and actually, I just started uh, running with music for the first time this year. Normally, I didn't run with music, and it's uh, it's definitely better. That you, you get to uh, block out the rest of the world and uh, uh, maybe uh, improve your time a bit. Yeah. Uh, don't why, don't we just love Fanwood for giving us the chance to run in the park and in this great town? That's uh, that's absolutely correct. Uh, I moved here about 13 years ago, um, and uh, it's a great neighborhood. And this is like one big block party for the the whole neighborhood to, neighborhood to come out and uh, celebrate. We just had a block party last night. That, that we did. <laughs> I wish you were there. <laughs> hey, hey, don't call me out on TV. <laughs> we love Fanwood. Thanks, Lee. Oh, thank you. I am very to be standing with the number one first place winner of the Fanwood 5K race. What is your name? Rufino Mendez. Congratulations. You, you came in like a bullet. That was really fast. Was slow. Do you know what was your time was? I think 1744. Whoa. Um, how many 5Ks have you run? Yesterday I did one. I got second and today I came to this race. And you said that's slow? Yeah. What was your best time ever? Like 1630s. Wow. Oh my gosh. Um, are you human? <laughs> what do I look like? <laughs> um, so what do you do to prepare? Just work. Just all, train? All, all day long. No. I don't train. You don't train? No. Oh my gosh. Wow. One twice a day. I I'm going to ask you again. Are you human? <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah, of course. Um, so where are you from? Originally from Mexico. Okay, wow. So how did you hear about this race? I saw on the website. Uh, it's called um, Race Form, something like that. So then I said, let me go check it out, that race. Awesome. We're glad you came and blown us all away. <laughs> and who are these people with you? They are my friends. Oh, he just has come back here. That's his work. My name is Angel. That's my, my best friend, Rufino. Now we're gonna best go back friends. To work. And going back to work. Hard workers. And what's your name? Jaime. And how do you know each other? Uh, they're my friends. We're from the same town. Friends? We together. Uh, girlfriend. Oh, how nice to support each other. Good people. Glad to meet you. Hey, what's your name? Hi, John Lutowski. Nice. Are, are you a fan of president? Scotch Plains. Scotch Plains? I feel like everybody here knows you. Yeah, because I'm both squads. That's why. Oh, you're with the yeah. squad. That's yeah. why. Okay. So now I know you. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> so how many times have you done this race? This is first. Your first I'm, time. I'm Congrats. Um, what got you into running? I don't run. I walk. If I had to run, it'd give me an oxygen tank. <laughs> so you walked this. Yeah. Okay. So that's peaceful and relaxing. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. Thank you. Um, how do you feel? Tired. Tired. Hot. 
<laughs> All right. Well, thanks for talking with us. Oh, good. We got the big man on campus with us, Joe Valenti. So happy to speak with you right now. You've put a lot of work into this event. Yeah, it's a, it's a big event that we plan for all year, and I'm glad the town really enjoys it. You know, it's, it's a great local race. Uh, it, I mean, reality is we get all our uh, entrance in the last seven days, so it's hard to manage that, but, you know, we're here for the town. So who else um, helps out with running this? Uh, behind the uh, Family and Recreation, the uh, committee, we have a separate committee that I operate with that helps us all year long, but as well as we, we, we liaise with the uh, rec committee as well. So the big idea is to raise money for the Fanwood Recreation and their programs, is that correct? Yes, this all goes back to the town and the Fanwood Recreation programs. Uh, we have the October uh, Halloween uh, party that will be on the 31st that I hopefully everyone will come, up, come out for. We do uh, the Christmas uh, pictures with the uh, Santa Claus. We have an Easter Bunny, uh, we have Party in the Park, we have all the uh, movies in the park, so this goes to support all those things, as well as the facilities. Like uh, this year we'll be getting um, a skate park in Forest Road Park, so all these proceeds help us uh, support those events. Oh, that's so cool. That's the first I heard about the skate park. Yeah. We were um, psyched about it. It was a long time planning. Yeah, psyched. That's a good word for the skate park. Mm -hmm. um, so h how much money do you hope to raise uh, this year? In sponsorship, we raised about uh, 11500 and then after we pay expenses, hopefully we'll make some more money. Okay. Are you, are you looking for volunteers? Could you always use a little extra help? We're always looking for volunteers, especially uh, race marshals and anybody looking to do a service project. It's very helpful. This, this is a whole volunteer race and we couldn't do it without volunteers. Okay, so is there, what's the best way to contact you? Uh, you can go on the Fanwood uh, website for recreation and you can contact Bob Budiansky or myself, Joe Valenti. Okay, thank you so much. Is there anything else you'd like to add? Come back again next year. Male, 13 and under, Malcolm Cahora, Scotch Plains, 21-17-62. Thank you. You're Second place, female, 13 and under, Janai Berry, Fanwood, New Jersey, 27, 44, 90. Third place, female, 13 and under, Julia Flood, Fanwood, New Jersey, 27, 49, 99. Okay, male finishers, 14 to 18, Jonathan Kuzalu, Fanwood, New Jersey, 20, 20 21, 55. Okay, male, 19 to 24, Brandon Rolnock, West New, Westfield, New Jersey, 23, flat 06. Thank you. Female, 19 to 24, first place, Stephanie Frieri, Scotch Plains, 34, 33, 95. Okay, male, 25 to 29, Derek Wood, first place, 1937, 77. Thanks, bud. Female, 25 to 29, first plate, Kate Johnston, Chambersburg, Pennsylvania, 260246. Thanks. Let's go, Rem. Okay, male, 30 to 34, first place, Robert Lynn, Fanwood, New Jersey, 192017. Okay, male, 40 to 44. Jamie Perez, first place. Elizabeth, 22 to 2070. Female, 40 to 44. First place, Heather Benz, Westfield, 23 58 73. Thank you. Okay, male, 45 to 49. Daniel Joplin, Family, New Jersey, 1934 69. Thank you. Thank you. Female, 45 to 49, Holly Dabrowski, Highland Park, 260203. 
Okay, male, 50 to 54. First place, Todd Schwartz Edison, 21, Female, 50 so to 54. Much. First place, Susan Dodzo, Scotch Plains, 27.03.65. Okay, male, 55 to 59. First place, Brian Clancy, Pittstown, New Jersey, 20.14.99. Thank you very much. Female, 55 to 59. Mary Susan Okay, female, 60 to 64. First place, Fran Zabashi. Coming to your new 30 volume, 49 69. Okay, male, 65 to 69. First place, Uno Brito, Kenilworth, New Jersey, 22 Okay, male, 75 to 79. First place, Alex, Alex Dobrowski, Highland Park, 28-31-72. Thank you very much. Thank you. Hey, thank you. Thank you for staying.
check your number. We're looking for number 227. And that's a wrap. The 2015 6th Annual Fanwood 5K and Family Fun Run is officially finished. I'm a little winded now, but that was a really fun morning. And I hope to see everybody again next year. Thanks for tuning in to Fanwood TV. I'm Kelly Magnus. See you next time.